who's ready for some more Fallout action. Let's see if we can survive the wasteland today. doing here we have to go investigate Concord uh, the only thing we did uh, since we signed off was just uh, we went to sleep real quick to save so it's now 8 a.m. and uh, we took a brief stop off here at the um, the red rocket um, station or whatever um, I think we're pretty ready to go. We have uh, we have a little bit of, of rad. We have a couple rads on us. Um, I'm not too concerned just yet. Um, investigate Concord. Yeah, let's just let's just head down there. I'm sure it's safe. Codsworth did say it was a little rough. What? <laughs> Baseball bat. Might take that. Might be able to mod that. Make a nice melee weapon at some point in the future. Box. I don't trust this town for whatever reason. Poster. Vigilant. Communism is coming. God. Oh. Shit's gone down. Do I want to be going towards the gunfire? Concord Civic Access. Let's go look in there. You know what? I might, uh, I might switch my. Here, I might switch myself over to that side, cover up. I'll cover up my health bar, but uh, at least at least my my AP and my statuses and ammo and all that stuff visible. Sounds good. Box over there. A couple boxes over there. Uh, 
I might actually want to drop down there. What the hell is that? What is that? That looks very dangerous. <laughs> oh god, this is a bad idea. So, oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> no! Thing just one shot me. Oh god. Well, here is where the no saving thing is gonna, gonna get me. I just, I gotta be more careful. I gotta be more careful. I'm all the way back here. Okay. Don't, don't take my advice on how to survive in the wasteland. What fruit? Might come in handy. I'm, see, I'm playing... <laughs> making the mistake of playing this game like I would... I don't know, any other action game. But with survival mode on like this, it's it's a whole different story. I knew the thing was dangerous. I don't, I don't know what I was doing. I gotta remember that I am a weakling right now. Now, I am still gonna go down there. But I just, I can't... I gotta sneak around it. I can't be making foolish decisions. Let's go back down. Let's not play this the same way that I did. So going down there might just be completely out of question. No. Oh god, no, 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 dog. Damn it, dog. Head over there. Over here. He's gonna he's gonna bring him right up here. God. Ah, oh, God. Shotgun shell. I'm gonna lose my dog. Take that weapon. Oh my God, this is how we're gonna die. This is how we're gonna die. Come on. Move here. It will head home if they're okay. So I don't. I won't lose it. The dog will come back. I guess. Damn it! This thing.
Oh. Wait, why didn't my... Oh, sh Okay, I used the wrong button. <laughs> I'm not very good at using vats. I would have done better just to shoot him point blank. So I might just leave the dog here. Hey. Over here. Wait there. Yeah. I think I think you just need to stay. Wait, how do I? Come on. Hold position. Okay. Yeah. Stay there. Can't have you coming with me. You gotta stay. You cause too many problems. Oh, Nuka-Cola Quantum. Might come in handy at some point. Bobby pin box. Where was there, um... Yeah, let's go back and check that cave. Let's see if we can uh, lockpick our way into this deal. Go back here, right? Alright, how do we do this? A driver. Lease A. Go. Nice. We have some rounds, duct tape, some mines. Let's take it all. You know what? I could maybe use a mine to take care of that uh, that creature down there, that mire lurk. Excuse me. Actually, these glass bottles might be. Might be helpful in the future. Yeah, maybe I'll set a mine down and then lure it towards me. Because I want I want to check that raider body that the thing is like gnawing on down there. bring this stuff back here real quick. Can I open this door from the outside? No. That one down. Oh, the baseball bat is actually... Oh, it's slower. More damage, but slower. You can change its color, just for fun. That's it, huh? I don't need 
Hmm. I kind of want to save that adhesive, though. Spiked and sharp are the same. Oh, no, it's not. Sharp bleeds. I kind of want to save those upgrades, th those materials for something else on this, I think. Combat scope. Better focus and sighted accuracy. frame receiver. Yeah. Let's do that. How's my weight doing right now? Doing okay. Parched and I'm hungry. Currently, I want to take on more, more rads. Purified water. Hmm. Man, this is gonna be this is gonna be so much more tough. Still parched. Intelligence is down. All right, I'm not going to worry about it right now. All right, let's see if I can survive this <laughs> civic access. Less rads than the dirty water that I drank previously. All right, now what's the best way? Use a grenade. I only have one mine. Maybe a Molotov? That might work against the armor. Oh, it didn't really work the way I wanted it to. not placing it. That's not placing it. Why isn't it placing it? Oh god, everything's freezing. 
Got it. <gasps> Alright, stim. I need a stim pack. If we're gonna survive this, I need a stim, stim pack. Oh god. Ah, god. Everything started freezing up on me. It's getting all choppy for some reason. It's not great. I wonder if it's right. Hmm. This might be a problem. Here we are. Hey. Dog. Wait there. Need to stay. I wonder what it was about that time that made it get all choppy. Okay. Let's do this all one more time. Oh, stuck behind the door. Stuck. We're just gonna have to drink this. uses it or just pulls it out. Alright, the Molotov cocktail didn't... Oh, I don't have that mine anymore either. I think grenade might be the way to go. That worked. Worked like a charm. Stinker trunk. Right, all right, all right. Jet. 
whole bunch of materials and drugs. Dog food. I think these cans. I need some aluminum to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, see, now we're feeling good. Taboo tattoo. Permanently unlock a new unique facial tattoo. <laughs> Taboo tattoos. Do I have to use it? Enter, read. Oh, I guess that's just it. I just hold it. it. Doesn't have any weight. Okay. Alright, now, before I die, should I sleep down here for an hour? Yeah, let's do that. There's a mattress right here. That way I'm saved. Brown stim pack. Low sighted heavy pipe pistol? Hell yeah. Oh, it was a shotgun last time. Oh well. It's interesting though that, to know that it's it's a little random like that. Not always the same. Lunchbox. Fusion core? Does the lunchbox do anything for me or is it just junk? A lunchbox. Or a collectible. Maybe I can sell it. Maybe someone's like looking for him or something like that. Alright, so wait. I got some more. No, I want the jumps. Long johns are not as good. This will add on top of it, though, I guess. Yeah. Put both rings on? No. Alright. I got some armor. Wow, the machete actually does better damage. Here, maybe let's... Yeah, let's use the machete there. Uh, other side, heavy pipe pistol. Maybe let's put that... Grenade can go there. Melt-up cocktail there. Short pipe rifle. It's not a particularly good weapon, though. Baseball bat's actually better than the machete. Interesting. armor. Alright, so now how we switch between... Alright, just like that. Cool. I'm gonna use this for the time being. Not as good as my other pistol, but I'd rather it go bad. Great, huh? Oh, 
Oh no! <laughs> there we go. Yes. Why is it so excited? It's garbage. I can break these open. Hmm. Doesn't look like I can do anything with that. down this way. Oh. Good God. All right, if I'm going to be fighting stuff melee, I got to get better at the timing. There's all sorts of tunnels down here. Gotta remember, there could be traps. Door. What exactly are we doing? Toolbox. Nice. Feeling good. Okay. Bullets. Oh, yeah. I, what is the point of the vault tech lunchboxes? <laughs> Wonder glue scalpel. Chained. Chained on the other side. Hmm. I wonder if that's just like another way down here. Plutonium well. Hmm. Wonder how I get in there. All right. Well, I certainly can't do it right now, so I'm just gonna keep on moving. A little worried about my HP. I can eat some food and get some rads. Oh god, I'm starting to fill up with. I'm going to be carrying too much stuff soon. Yeah, survival is going to make... Make it much harder to carry tons of stuff.
That's good, though, because the original game, that was sort of a problem. You just were always carrying everything. Bunch of drugs. Um... Day Tripper. Better luck, charisma, strength. Alright, I think Jet we're gonna want on favorite. Damage resist, poison resist. Alright, Mentats are for when we're like talking or doing something for intelligence. Psycho. Oh, wait. Hold on. I already forgot what Jet does. Slows time. Right, okay, so if I'm in the middle, middle of a battle, I can use that real quick. Oh my god. Oh my god, I leveled up. What are we going to add? Damage resistance. Take less radiation. I kind of want damage resistance. Because I'm worried about dying all the time. Yeah, we'll do that a little bit. For a bug. Duct tape, hook lighter. Alright, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get more rad roach meat at this time. Maybe use some new people. What's that? Boy alien? I don't know if that's helpful or not. Alright, where do these stairs lead? Probably somewhere dangerous. Alright, before I go up there, I'm going to sleep one more time. Oops, I took the spare pillow. So, I think the only thing we lose from sleeping like this is just that it uses it like we're going to get hungrier. Hungrier and, th like, hunger and thirst. That's the main problem for doing that, I believe. All right, let's have our pistol out, because we don't know what's going to happen here. I assume this is just like another way to get through the city, basically. Please don't put me right out in the middle of some terror nightmare. It's hitching for some reason. Kitchen a little bit. I 
wonder if that's the mods causing an issue. Just waiting to see if it uh, eases up a little bit. It's really weird. I've never had this problem before. I wonder if it has to do with my ultra wide monitor. This works fine. It's only when I'm rendering the rest of the world. Um, well, I might just let's see. Uh, let's see what happens if I load. Um, since I saved right there, um, let's just see if uh, if reloading that outside helps. Because the rest of the game has worked fine. It's only suddenly started happening today. If it continues to be a problem, I'll, uh, I'll pause for a bit and work on, you know, fixing the tech situation. Yeah, see, now it works fine. So if I had to guess, like, if, it's, if it continues to be a problem, I'll just, um, I'll start unloading mods and assuming that it's, like, something to do with that. Whoa. I definitely do not want to mess with that. Can I help? Who's the good guy in this situation? Please don't shoot me. More of them? Says I'm in danger. Armor. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. Oh, hell yeah. All your stuff for sure. Hey, up here! Oh, on the balcony! I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us, please! Where? Oh god. Alright, I'm carrying too much. I gotta, I gotta drop some stuff. that raider right arm. Let's just drop that. That's okay, yeah. Uh, sack hood does help protect against radiation. Okay. Um, we'll get rid of this, this jumpsuit. That. 
Unfortunately, the militia hat is not as good as the other thing. Okay. Better... So the leather gives better electric... Get rid of that. Not as good base damage resist, though, it looks like. I don't know. I think I'm gonna... Okay, that's seven pounds. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get rid of the Raider one, just because it's heavier. And I know, I know weight's gonna end up becoming a problem. And we got, where is it? Short laser musket. All right, let's favorite that. Fantastic. All right, let's go inside. Let's see what they have to say. Hopefully they have a bed. Oh my god, what are you shooting at? Oh, that is a raider. Oh god, reload. Oh god. Oh, I gotta like keep... Do I hold it? Or like, how many... Oh, it just holds two rounds, I guess. Oh, this thing is awesome. Oh, it must have more power if it's charged twice. It looks like two is the best I can do. All right, that's locked. Concerned. I'm concerned that they're gonna shoot me while I'm looting for stuff, so I should go take care of them first. No more British occupation. Oh. <laughs> Alright, that works. Stim pack. God, I'm carrying too much. Yeah, this is going to be a constant problem because I'm going to want to keep looting all the time. Might have to drop one of these. Yeah, let's drop some of these pistols. Drop the security baton. It's pipe. I just don't. I don't need pipe pistols. You know, it's just going to be a waste. Get rid of those. Put that on. Oh yeah, gas mask. Let's get rid of the sack hood. Am I gonna wish I had the security deposit? I'm wondering if I, because I, I wanna, um, I wanna like upgrade it at some point. I feel like. I don't know why this one has more weight and less value. Just get rid of them. There's got to be more guys in here, right? Oh, yeah. 
bolt action rifle. I wonder if I should switch. 34 damage. It's actually better damage. Better accuracy too. I'll just keep using the musket. It's working. this down here? Security gate. Um, I'll keep this one. It said plus. Maybe that's just maybe that's just the one that's more like more valuable. All right, we got a hack. Yo, trooper, what's going on, man? Yes, this is Fallout. This is this is the real deal. Like a potential password, incorrect number of letters that match the terminal's password. Letter M will be displayed on screen. Full survival, man. And don't some of these things do... Like, doesn't this do something? Oh, I thought, like... Was it parentheses? Oh yeah, like this. Yeah, yeah, dud removed. Okay. But it doesn't always do that, right? Like sometimes it just... All right, well, let's start with times. Likeness, zero, okay. That means it's not lover. Uh, so far, it's very difficult. Uh, <laughs> not being able to save wherever I want is huge. Also, uh, the weight of items, like, I cannot just loot whatever I want. Um, I can't remember, I, there's some, I get some, like, terrible, like, negatives if I'm over-encumbered. Um, I take damage to my legs, um, all sorts of stuff like that. Um, have you ever played the survival mode? squad could be wild could be squad could be wild ah, there we go unlock that shit Um, yeah, so you can only save when you sleep in a mattress or a sleeping bag. Um, and it's really, and you, like, you have to, you have to eat food, you have to drink water, um, or else all sorts of bad things happen, and, like, you, you get severely reduced strength to carry stuff, and, and lots of bad things happen if you're over-encumbered as well. Uh, there's no fast travel. Um, it's very scary. Very, very scary. I got a fusion core. Um, I also really don't remember very much of this game at all. Like, I, I really did not play very much of it. Like, I played, like, maybe 15, 20 hours, which, as you know, in a game like this, really is nothing. 
just the simple fact of not being able to pick up everything you see is already changing the game entirely. Because usually you just you pick up everything. It doesn't matter. But here it's like, I can't just pick up seven pistols. You can't carry seven pistols with you. So, you know, I, it's going to be much slower to, like, get the things I need. Yeah, substantial rewarding, definitely. Like, I, I've been into, like, one little cave, and it felt like this huge endeavor. And when I finally got out, I like, I breathed easy, you know? And it's like, it felt, felt good. All right, you know what? I think... I gotta drop some stuff. I can't... I'm gonna drop that pipe auto pistol. I'm gonna drop the short pipe rifle. I have these extra... See, I really want to save these to bring them back and break them down. See how we can get away. Switchblade. I, I can't just be carrying bottles around, you know? Uh, power suits. Yeah, I've I don't think I've ever used a power suit yet. It's gonna be it's gonna be very important, I imagine. Bag of cement. See, that sounds great, but I can't carry it. Yeah, see, so over encumbered, you lose two agility, two endurance, and you take periodic damage. So like, yeah, see, I have all this junk. I can't carry this all around. Bag of cement. Concrete. I, well, I think we're just gonna we're just gonna have to drop that. We can't be carrying a bag of cement around with us while we while we fight. It's too heavy. Steel? I don't need steel. I can find steel everywhere. Oil and springs. See, that's more important. A little bit of glass. Plastic I need. Are there more raiders up here? I'm parched from lack of water. Also, like, managing my meds is going to be much more important this time around. Um, just because... It's like, cause I, I, I need to eat. So I'm going to be con just carrying a bag of cement through the wasteland. Yeah. <laughs> it's important, you know? But it's like, I have to drink and I have to eat. So now, like, my rads... It's going to be much more important to, like, manage my rad situation. Yeah, desk fan. I I need it. I need it. It's very important for my survival to have that desk fan. Alright. I like it because it, it it stops. Run out to a place, throw in back to an outhouse to store the junk. Yeah, yeah, totally. Um, that's that's going to be much more necessary. But it also is nice because usually you play these games and you just go through and you pick up everything. You, you look at every single thing, you loot it all, and you take it without even thinking about it. But now it's like I really have to think about it. It makes it, it just makes it feel a little bit more methodical and, and purposeful, you know? Did I kill a guy up here? Did he fall? Must have, must have been the guy that fell down there. I ran into a mire lurk. Oh. 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 I see you. <laughs> What'd you say about someone shooting the place up? Tire iron, welding goggles. I don't need that.
gas shotgun. That's what I want. See, now I'm carrying too much again, though. I'm gonna have to drop some junk. Dirty ashtray? Yeah, get rid of it. No thought, I'll get rid of it. I'm wearing all that stuff. Can't get rid of that stuff. I think I gotta get rid of one of these. Is the baseball that's slow, though? That's why I want to keep the machete. Alright, we're gonna get rid of the baton. Mirelurks are scary, yeah. And, and this thing, it was... I ended up... See, usually I would just, like, ran around it. I would have shot it a bunch of times. This time I just used one of my few... I had two grenades. I just used a grenade. It's just like, no, you gotta do it. Uh, no, there's no fast travel. There is no fast travel. I don't need a switchblade. Maybe I'll just get rid of the machete as well. Just keep the baseball bat. Cooking pot has copper in it, though. I don't really want to get rid of that. I think I have to, though. It's too heavy. It's all too heavy. Yeah, dude, I... I don't know how I'm going to manage it, to be honest. I just gotta get... Oh, this meat. Oh, this is a ton of weight. Alright, let's, let's drop a bunch of this. Actually, let's just drop it all. There we go. No, no pipe rifle. I'll take the chems, though. Everything just feels very scary now. Whereas before. Come on, in there, and Come on man. they ain't going nowhere. We got other shit to deal with. You hear that? I gotta go take a little walk. And I'll be back. And you'll be dead. Oh, oh, oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little slow with the VAT system uh, on computer. Yes, take the drugs. Oh god, there's more of them. There's more of them. I hear him. Short old old shotgun. God, it's too much. It's always too much. I guess I could take. How long? Uh, which which uh, thing does it? That gives me more strength. Psycho. No. All right. Well, I gotta take a stim pack for sure. Doesn't one of these things make me stronger? buff out, but it's only five minutes, so that's not going to be enough time to be able to carry my stuff. Oh wait, now I have some sort of status thing. I'm parched. Over encumbered still. Oh my god. Oh my god. So many problems. <laughs> so many problems. Carrying two shotguns.
taking drugs to carry more stuff seems like a good way to get an addiction. <laughs> You're not wrong. I don't think I can carry two shotguns. I think I just gotta, I gotta put one down. And I gotta put one of these down too. Oh god, that pains me so much. I want to take them back so I can, I can like, take them apart. I know I'm going to walk into some trip mine, and it's going to be terrible. Right away. Duct tape. Maybe some sensor module? What was that? What are these sensors? Wrong sensors, wrong everything. To may concern, we received a new version of your program. You sent us the Pip Boy edition. All these doohickeys sent us in last year's model. Hundreds of them. What are we gonna do with all these? Never seen those sensors? We expect you to send a courier to pick these up, as well as deliver the correct program. Newer model ones we ordered, and we want all the optional people to for our trouble, including the taser. Thank god, I don't think I can take any more colonial flute and drums. Just heard from upstairs, the renovations are almost done. Only a month or so more. Probably back to City Hall before Thanksgiving. What are the sensors? Are they heavy? Should I be taking them all? <laughs> what? Are they in here? Where are they? No, I don't want to. I don't want to drop them. ASIM Sensor 2077 model. Uh... Weighs nothing. City Manager Holotape. Okay. You can now build city-zoned plots in your settlements, which settlers will bill on. Each requires an ASIM sensor. Oh! That's what this is. Okay. Okay, so this is one of the mods that I installed. That's what this all is. Um, I, I, I had forgotten that you have to find it somewhere. So I installed a special thing called... Um, what is it? It's like Sim Settlers. So changes the entire um like city building sort of situation it allows you to set up plots kind of like sim city where it's like this is uh, an industrial zone this is a comfort zone whatever i don't remember what they're called but you can set up all these zones and then it has an ai for all of the um all of the settlers and they will construct buildings automatically based on your parameters so it sort of streamlines things and makes more sense because then it's not one man going and building a settlement you like you talk to the people, and you get them to build the settlement for you because they're the ones that are living there. So they'll set up shops for you to buy things from and, and all that sort of thing. Um, so I have to do... Okay, sim settlements, yeah. Tons of options so you can play how you like. Um, and I was told I had to run the configuration wizard here. Um, yeah, so this... This streamlines it? But also, it adds depth to it, if I understand correctly. Um, it, it seemed to be because, because I didn't, as you know, I didn't love the building stuff. It just, it, it mostly just felt too disconnected from the rest of the game. So this, the whole point of this mod is that it's supposed to make it a little bit more involved and like thematic. 
All right, so I just have to answer a couple questions here. Um, how challenging would you like settlement management to be? Um, I don't mind a challenge as long as it's fun. That sounds good. Which appeals to you more? Finding the balance required to create a successful city? Uh, I want balance. Yeah. I want the city to make sense. How do you want settler assignment? Um, I'll handle all the assignments myself. No. Let Sim handle idle settlers only. I'm not sure about this one. I'm not sure whether I want... Because I kind of like the idea that I can't control the settlers, right? They're their own people. So they should just be able to go do whatever it is they're doing. Yeah, I'm really curious how this plays out. Um, I might have to come back and change these once I see how it works. I kind of want them to do everything. Let Sim Settlements handle idle settlers only. I assume this means if I don't give someone something to do, maybe I'll do that. Automate. Okay, no, I'll choose upgrade paths. That sounds good. So then I'll choose the direction I want it to go, and it'll just sort of do all those automatically. City upgrades. And it'll automatically. Yeah, I like the idea that I'll leave a city, and then I'll come back, and they'll have built, you know, something new or whatever. They'll be notified as things happen. I don't want to know everything. I only care about buildings, finishing construction, or upgrades. This sounds ideal. I think. Alright. Configured. Options. Tax laws. Tools. I can't use that here. This is really neat. Govern your city. Taxes are collected periodically and deposited in your local workbenches. Lower taxes encourage growth and happiness, but make paying for city services such as defense and power more difficult. Wow. This is cool. Yeah. Alright, well let's do our level up thing while we're here. Well, actually, I have, to, I have to back out of this. Alright. I'm also finding that I'm picking my perks a little differently. Like, usually I would just pick, like, all, um, you know, upgrades, gun nut, uh, lock picking, hacking. I would do all that, but now I'm like, I need toughness. You know, I need damage. Um, it seems to be, like, much more important. Um, so stealth also might be, I usually don't pick stealth but that might become much more important this playthrough um, because I just I cannot I, I can't stand up to damage nearly as much so I might do stealth real quick here Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Um, let's continue with what we were doing. There was a man up here that told me to grab the gun and come up. Doesn't look great. Is that a raider, or is that... Are you friends? Oh, you're friends. Hey, guys. Man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minutemen. God damn it. Minutemen? Minutemen? <laughs> I look terrified. <laughs> Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. 
So I joined up, wanted to make a difference. And I did, but things fell apart. Now it looks like I'm the last minute man left standing. All right. But, oh my God. I, why would they let me in here? Uh, <laughs> who are these people? <laughs> Just folks looking for a new home, a fresh start. I've been with them since Quincy. <laughs> Lexington looked good for a while, but the ghouls drove us out of there. A month ago, there were 20 of us. Yesterday, there were eight. Now we're five. You don't seem like a very good leader. It's just me, the Longs, Marcy and June. That's all Mama Murphy on the couch. And this here is Sturgis. Hey. <laughs> hey. What's up, Sturgis? <laughs> Sounds rough. Sorry. Sounds rough. God damn it. Thanks. It's good to meet someone who really cares. <laughs> that was the really anyway, cares option. <laughs> we figured Concord would be a safe place to settle. Those raiders proved us wrong. Nope. But, well, we do have one idea. You gonna tell it to me? <laughs> Let's hear it. <laughs> Sturgis, tell him. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Old school, pre-war. You might have seen it. Well... Looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. We're talking a full suit of cherry T-45 power armor. Military issue. Sounds useful. That's some serious protection. Oh, it gets better. Get the suit. You can rip the minigun right off the vertibird. Do that, and those raiders get an express ticket to hell. You dig? I dig, bro. Could work. It'll work, provided we can reactivate the suit. It's totally out of juice. Probably has been for a hundred years. It can be powered up again, but we're a bit stuck. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs> so, what's the solution? After that fusion core what I got. What need is an old pre-war FC. Oh yeah, I did. Standardized fusion core. Your high-grade, long-term nuclear battery used by the military and some companies way back when. And we know right where to find one. But we can't get to the damn thing. It's down in the basement. Boys, boys. Behind I already handled it. Gate. I got yeah. it under control. I fix stuff. I tinker. Bypassing security ain't exactly my forte. You could give it a shot. <laughs> already have it, bro. Actually, I already grabbed the fusion core. We're set. Well, all right. Maybe our luck's finally turning around. Once you jack the core into the power armor and grab that minigun, those raiders will know they picked the wrong fight. Good luck. <sighs> Toothpaste. I don't want to talk to you people. Careful, kid. Excuse me? There's something coming. What'd you say to me? It's it's angry. <laughs> I'm angry, lady. I'm angry. Oh, watch. Take that. Oh, hello. Perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you, do you guys have a mattress that I could sleep on real quick? Because I'm a little worried about... <laughs> worried about everything man I need to I need to find a sleeping bag I need to start carrying it around with me I'm thirsty I'm peckish god if there's not a mattress in here what am I going to do alright well let's drink drink and eat Got some cram. I have. Oh man. I don't really want to use purified water. I lose intelligence and perception. Perception affects weapon accuracy in vats. Hmm. 
Do I drink some of my, my purified water? Feel better, but still parched. God damn it. If there's not a bed up here, I might have to run back to town. Because I'm a little worried about... Oh, God, there's not. Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. This past Saturday, October 23rd, while en route to West Stockbridge, a vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. The cause? EMP following nuclear detonation. Several, in fact. From the intel I've gathered, this was a global event. The co-pilot was killed on impact. The pilot died of his injuries a day later. The day after that, Jesus. Flaherty and Kanawa were shot by some scared, desperate survivors. Then Brzezanski took off running. Haven't seen him since. Now, it's my turn to go AWOL, if that concept even applies anymore. My armor's fusion core is burned out, so... I guess my soldiering days are done. I'm heading to Boston, on foot, to see if my sister survived all this. She's got an apartment on Boylston Street. This is Mike Daly, signing out. Good luck. And God bless America. Or what's left of it. Uh, I'm gonna die like this. I know it. Oh, man. I have a whole bunch of fusion cores. Where did I get all these? <laughs> Uh, well, let's put a full one in there, I think. Alright, well, I guess we're just doing this. I really hope we don't die. Reduce oh, wow, look at this. Oil can, gas canister. All right, well, I'm nervous about this. Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy gun up close. a lot of people to get back, my boy. Oh, this is pretty intense. <laughs> Is that it? Is that the mission? Oh wait. Do I jump down there? I definitely, I, I'm worried about going down there. I feel like there was one person at the front door. Yeah, yeah. Uh oh, ammo's low. What's going on? Just doing my day's work. Whoa, grenades? No, thank you. What is that? There's a very large creature out there. Alright, so is this mission still going on? Clear Concord of Hostiles. 
Do they want me to jump down there? I'm concerned about that, to be honest. Uh-oh. Why? Why? Uh-oh. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, I did it. Whatever that creature is seemed to do it. Is that one of those is that one of those uh things from Fallout 3? A death claw? That's what it is, isn't it? Alright. I'm going back. I did it! <laughs> it's all good. I did it. Okay, so I can carry... I can carry 50 more pounds with this thing on. I'm glad I didn't jump down there. And I'm now never taking this armor off ever again. Excuse me. Minutemen were supposed to protect us. Garby promised. He promised. Oh. Bingo. Who's the Atomic Command Hollow Tape game? <laughs> Great. Where's Garby? Sturgis, you got some? Hey, Sturgis. Any day now, new guy. Well, I did it. What, what do you mean any day now? Don't talk to me like that. Don't talk to me like I didn't just do your job. I can, I can like jump down with this thing, right? Yeah. I'm a little worried about going out there though now. Oh god, it's over there. Where am I supposed to go? Clear Concord of Hostiles. Did I not do it? Tired from lack of sleep. It's acting like I still have to deal with this. Can I take this thing on? In the suit? It's definitely that. I'm really worried about fighting this thing. I'm going to lose so much progress. Oh god. Go, 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 go! <laughs> oh my god, I was not entering it near enough. <laughs> well, now I might be stuck in here forever. No more British occupation. What do I do? Oh, well, now it's closer. Maybe I'll go back up on the roof. I, I don't have a ton of ammo left. I'm going to go up. <laughs> it's pretty funny, right? 
It's great. Yeah, shoot it from the roof. Yeah, yeah. No, wait, I don't want to use the... Definitely does not do a lot of damage. I guess it's just the, the sheer amount of bullets. Oh, wait. Yeah, fancy lads. I don't know. It seems... It seems like they set you up for failure on this one. Maybe I was using too much of my ammo from too far away. Maybe I should have shot it originally from up there and gotten it closer. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, it's way out there. Here, hold on. Let's... How do I get out of this thing? How, how, how to get out? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. I almost walked off the edge. I don't remember how to get out. <laughs> there we go. No, that's not it. Oh, there is a flashlight. Oh, it must only be on. I probably don't always have one. There we go. Thank you. Hold F. It was hold E, but I got I got the meaning. God, now I'm over encumbered. Okay, so what gun do I have that can maybe hit him from here? What's the best accuracy gun I have? 70. 74. Got a couple shots with this. I could at least bring him closer. No scope. Wait, something's out there. Okay. Here you are. Hopefully it won't somehow leap up here. It's running away. Gone. It's gone. I don't see it. It's too smart for us. I've lost visual contact. Just waiting. Looks like they're gone. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh god, I'm taking damage because I'm carrying too much without my power armor on. Gotta drop that again. Shit, did I pick up that much stuff? Yeah, definitely want to bring it to the base. No doubt. Uh, let's eat these. Eat some dandy boy apples. Uh, 
drop the wrench. I want that oil. Wood, cloth, no thanks, no scalpel. Please. Antiseptic's probably gonna come. Oh good, yeah, I need that. Gear. Need that gear too. God, I'm carrying, just, I'm just carrying too much. But I'm gonna keep taking damage. If I don't drop it. What do, what do I do? What do I do? Help me. Desk fans are heavy. None of this stuff is any weight. Miscellaneous is fine. Something here that, like, is really heavy. Nuka-Cola. Point five, the minigun. The minigun's just way too heavy. Here, let's drop that while we're not using it. There we go. Problem is though, I just I can't see him now. I guess I can jump back down in the suit. Provide that I don't take. Do you remember if I take, uh... Store some stuff in a container? Yeah, that's true. It's not a bad idea either. Do I take falling damage if I jump down with this thing? You know. Or can I just, can I just jump off and be fine? All right, well, we're going to try it, and if I die and lose an hour of progress, we know whose fault it is. <laughs> okay, we're good. <laughs> there it is. I'd, uh, all right, well, let's... My God! <laughs> All right, I gotta turn around immediately and open the door. Go 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 go! <laughs> I thought maybe I was gonna be okay. Oh my God! <laughs> so much damage! <laughs> it did so much damage. I can't believe that this is, like, literally the first thing they tell you to go do. Is to go fight the hardest enemy in the game. Door of safety. <laughs> you know what I probably should have done? I probably should have used a couple of those meds, like Jet or whatever. Now the real Dark Souls begins. I'm totally cheesing through this, but like, I, I don't know how else I can manage it. <laughs> these, these people, well, look who it is. Back again. We managed to kill the terrifying monster outside. I don't see them doing anything. The 
problem is, he's not going to be by the door again, is he? Yes, he's way out there again. Yeah, there, there really should be a bed in here. All right, so we're going to jump out again. We're going to drop the gun. We're going to take out... All right, let's... Uh, let's use another stim pack. Mildly dehydrated. I wonder if I should use another one. Eat some snack cakes. Some more purified water. Oh my god. Alright, I guess I gotta drink more water. I'm still thirsty. Jesus. It takes so much. Alright, let's see if we can get this thing's attention again. Hold up. We oh man, I'm out of ammo. There's no way this thing's gonna hit it. See, it's smart. It, r it runs behind the building again. Alright, so this is what we're gonna do. Grab the minigun. Jump back in. Equip the minigun. Okay. Luck, charisma. We're gonna use our jet. We're gonna use... The med -X. We're just gonna take all the all the drugs. We're gonna take Psycho, med -X, and then a jet. That's <laughs> scream. <laughs> Where is it, though? There we go. That's how we do it. That's how we take care of it. <laughs> I hope these people better be happy. <laughs> I'm now addicted to drugs because of their incompetence. <laughs> the drugs did nothing, I know. <laughs> I definitely didn't need him. I was just, I was worried he was going to rush me again. And I was going to get one hit, you know. Excuse me. Excuse me. That <laughs> Excuse me. a pretty amazing display. I'm just glad you're on our side. We're, we're not friends. I'm on my side, buddy. I'm on my own side, Garvey. That's a shame, man. You can never have too many friends in the Commonwealth. Listen, when we first met, you asked about the Minutemen. One thing you should know about us, we help out our friends. So here, for everything you've done, Thank you. You gave me a bunch of trash at a, fu a fusion core. Didn't help for money. Mm, 
I'll take it. I'll take what I can get. Hmm. Spoken like a true merc. Well, if you ever feel like fighting for something other than yourself, you should meet up with us in Sanctuary. I could use someone like you. Someone who can get things done. Where's Sanctuary? I'll give him a maybe. I'll think about it. Before you leave, kid, a word. <laughs> How about a bed? <laughs> about the journey you're about to start on. Because I've seen your destiny. And I know your pain. <laughs> Throw their eyes. <laughs> Help me, please. <laughs> My destiny? What do you mean? You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel... The Sanctuary has beds? That's, that's a plus. Alive. I'm listening. Look, kid. I know how I sound. The sight, it's weird. And it ain't always clear. But your son's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. The great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. <laughs> biggest settlement around. This lady's weird. That's vague. <laughs> That's vague. <laughs> Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some... Oh, now you're tired? Here. The sight will paint a clearer picture. Whoa, Mama Murphy, we talked about this. We, we talked about your drug addiction, Mama Murphy. Kill you. Oh, shush, Preston. <laughs> We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here. We need the sight. Need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All so right, folks. <laughs> Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. We're following the drug fiend. She knows about it? <laughs> you mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? Yeah. And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose Marcy chase? knows what's no up. better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? it can oh, hold, hold on, hold on. Worse than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together. Drug buds. Right. So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Mama Anybody? Murphy is traipsing around the wasteland well, with bunny slippers Sanctuary on. It is. <laughs> Let's just hope it lives up to its name. I don't know about this lady. Come on, June. It's time to go. Oh, okay. What? <laughs> June. <laughs> this would be me. <laughs> I'd just be like, uh, what? All right, I guess. All right. Well, bye, everyone. <clears throat> oh, my drugs wore off. Going. All right, well, I'm definitely going to... I'm not going to go right to Sanctuary, <laughs> June, yet. Can you guys go through the door more quickly? Why do you have to do a single file through the door? Just go. Go out there. <laughs> I need to use the door, too. Oh, great. Now the, do now the door is all bugged out. There we go. Um, I'm going to go back to the, the Red Rocket uh, station or whatever it is. I have a bed there. The dog's there. Don't forget the price we paid to get this far. Price you paid? Let's move out. I'll take points. Okay. Oh, Sanctuary is where I'm from. I gotcha. They took it over. Oh, okay. Well, that... Okay, that's great. Get close, everyone. We're right behind you, boss. All right, well, bye, guys. Some de it's a decapitated body. Alright, let's keep on moving. Worried about being out in the open like this, even with power armor on.
There's the rocket. Like, it feels so much more satisfying to be on my way back. Oh, God. Oh, God, I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo for that thing. Uh, here, what do we got here? Baseball bat's probably fine, right? Instead of using... Oh god, they're strong. Oh, they're running away. Alright, whatever. That's fine. But yeah, like, not being able to fast travel and having to make my way back, like, on foot, just after everything that happened. Uh, are those bugs coming back? It's, uh, it's significantly more satisfying. And I feel like that'll also make me feel better, like, more interested in having like, settlements and such, because, you know, it, it actually feels like a home then. When before, it's like, it didn't matter. You can just go wherever you want. Do whatever you want. Hey, dog. Oh, I can't do that one power armor. Alright, well, let's put this away. Can I... What's the best way to do this? Do I just like leave it like that? I guess? Oh, I see. Yeah, so now it's there. Health. Yeah, let's repair this thing. It seems like a good idea. Tinker, tinker, tinker. There we go. Yeah, sounds good, man. Thanks for stopping in. I'll uh, I'll talk to you a little later. Good spy. I'm gonna a good spot to stop for a couple minutes. So I'm gonna take a break and I'm gonna eat some lunch and then I will be back in about an hour. So yeah, thanks for watching and I'll be back soon. Thanks. <laughs>